in Aladdin. I, I mean, there, did that start out as one voice, the genie? Because yeah, they wanted me to do the script, and then I came in one day, uh, the first day, and read it and tried it, the scripted version. And then I asked, "Do you mind if I play?" And they went, "No, no, try." And I just went off and did everything I knew, and it was great because I, I did about I don't know how many. Uh, did they, they just let you run right? Oh, big time. <laughs> There's 30 hours of stuff that they eventually condensed. Mrs. Doubtfire's voice. And where is it exactly? Is it? Is it's it kind of a, it's a synthesis of um, it's like a Glaswegian accent because I just finished working with Bill Forsyth for four months, so it's uh, I first started doing uh, the voice was very much like that, <laughs> it's like Julia Child, and I realised that would scare even a hyperactive child, <laughs> so I had to kind of tune it down, and I got more like Margaret Thatcher on steroids, and it went down. <laughs> Listen to Jeannie, dear. Jeannie knows. You've got to get your mind off this incessant waiting. Here's a surefire way to cheer up a bummed-up ride to be. A heaping helping of matrimonial magic. <laughs> hey, that's no good. What the wedding needs is a theme. It needs a groom, too, but let's work with what we have. <laughs> it's a joke. I do that. <laughs> Listen, if I seem to be getting smaller, it's because I'm leaving! Oh. Put your fair man out! No! No! Oh, great! Happy now? I am not a mugger. I happen to be e ah. a scoundrel. I didn't know you were at the end of that foot. Oh. 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 Primary testing laboratory. No! Pass the probe. <laughs> Graduate students all gather forward. No! Hello. I'm a nocturnal placental flying mammal. A member of the family of Pterodidae or Pterodidna. <laughs> if you can't tell, I'm a bat! <laughs> yes, I am. And they used to call me Batty. Batty Coda. Babe Ruth and his best bat. Darling. He's everywhere. Every newsreel, every newspaper talks about Babe Ruth. Look at all this stuff. Babe Ruth Civic Cup, Babe Ruth Silver Dollars, Babe Ruth Underpants, obviously for the larger child. Babe Ruth does have a lucky charm. What is it? What is it? What is it? It's his bat. So what do we do? I'll tell you what we do. We take away his bat. Let's do the math. Starving minds, welcome to Dr. No. Where fast food for thought is served up 24 hours a day in 40,000 locations nationwide. Ask Dr. No, there's nothing I don't. Question me, you pay the fee. Two for five, you get one free. Greetings, colleagues. On offer, factual text, officialized text. First or third person. Usual literacy range from primal to postdoctoral. Usual span of styles from fairy tale to religious. Who's who or where's where? Or flat fact. That's cool, see you, Fatty! Oh, 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 oh. Did it take you a while to come up with that one? <laughs> <laughs> All right, way to go, tall guy. Give me pin, give me pin. <laughs> what, you got something better to do? Well, then come along, Fluffy, let's go. You heard the voice. Now you're about to meet the one and only Lovelace in the flesh. Right here, right on, right now. Let me tell something to you. What's a best friend for if you cannot bring a daddy and his boy together? Oh. Hello? Where are you? <sighs> hello, hello, hello? <sighs> We're still here for you, brother. Go ahead. Is there no end to the power of Sven? <laughs> Biscuits. Red biscuits, black biscuits. Is that all you think about? Biscuits, please, please, please. Nothing else matters. Biscuits, please. Look. I just can't concentrate on anything till I've had one of those biscuits. I know it's crazy, but that's how it is. I guess I'm kind of hooked on them. So please, give me just one biscuit, then I'll be able to think about something else. Hmm? Just be glad your wife didn't leave you for an albatross! My puny kiwi wings weren't good enough for Dolores. Oh, no, no. She had to have an albatross! With great, big, long wings. He was on hormones. You heard me read my beak. Hormones! Oh, my dear Lopez. So thank you.
but I still have to beat the eggs, whip the cream, and toss the salad. <laughs> Firstly, cooking is so vile. Well, I mean, uh, Louise jogged around with my time twister, and now she's <laughs> a prehistoric orchid. <laughs> a cave orc. Ah, salam and good evening to you, worthy friend. Please, please, come closer. Too close. A little too close. There. City of mystery. Ooh. Of enchantment. Uh, the finest merchandise this time ever shown. On sale today. Come on down. <laughs> Look at this. Yes. <laughs> Combination hookah and coffee maker. Also makes julienne fries. Oh, look at this. I have never seen one of these intact before. This is the famous Dead Sea Tupperware. Listen. <clears throat> ah, still good. <laughs> 10,000 years will give you such a crick in the neck. Hang on a ah. second. It's all part and parcel, the whole genie gig. Phenomenal cosmic power. Not to have to go, what do you need? What do you need? What do you need? To be my own master. Such a thing would be greater than all the magic and all the treasures in all the world. But what am I talking about? Let's get real here. It's not going to happen. <laughs> I'm free. I'm free. Genie, I'm, I'm going to miss you. <laughs> Me too, Al. No matter what anybody says, you'll always be a prince to me.